Congratulations. One, uh, first to support strongly what, what Cedric said a, a moment ago. For those of you who are wondering how you can finance a program like this and uh, later this morning may be wondering whether you want to go ahead with applying for one of the seed grants, I would be encouraging because these um, types of programs hit a sweet spot with a number of uh, uh, donors. Uh, there are many donors out there who want to support college students and college success who can't afford to endow a $50,000 scholarship. Uh, but by the vetting that we're doing, we're assuring that these students have genuine unmet need, we're assuring that they're doing what they need to do, plugging away academically and so forth, making progress. It's very appealing to uh, a, a number of donors that they can give $5,000 and have it benefit you know, five or six students. And so uh, we, have, we have seen that very clearly, and it, it, it's, it's, it's a really positive thing. Uh, w w what we found, though, is that every time, and this is how it should be, every time you begin to address one student success uh, issue, it makes you more uh, uh, viscerally aware of other problems. And I'll say what we're, one thing we're giving more thought to uh, at Georgia State are other types of emergency grants because these grants are specifically to cover tuition and fees. Uh, we have students coming forward or we have students being identified by faculty staff who have that whole host of other issues where they can't afford to pay their rent, their car is broken down and they can't commute to campus and these sorts of things. And we're not doing nearly enough in that category to be able to provide these kind of resources for students. So hopefully by beginning to address at least a portion of the tuition uh, uh, gap, uh, this will inspire the campus and some of our donors uh, to be able to address some of these other problems and concerns. Great, thank you very much. We're gonna take a pause there. Uh, we're gonna keep these panelists working hard again this morning. Uh, in the next session when we regather, we'll talk a bit about revenue sources, fundraising, um, potential roadblocks, uh, data collection approaches, and you'll have another opportunity to ask questions. But for the next 10 minutes, bio break, coffee, stretch your legs, and we'll regather here in 10 minutes.